We are in Port St. Lucie and we are at Urban Air Adventure Park. You know, I want to soon go in this place and shoot some video, but all right, so we just backed up here. We're going to be removing some scrap metal. I believe these long <clears throat> orange PVCs, tubing, the metal, steel, I'm sorry, uh, pallets, and these wood, whatever they were at one point. Man. <sighs> I really wish I was loading that thing up because I want to get one of those very, 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 very short. Anyway, okay, so this is James A&J's removal. Ashley's in the car. She probably sent out the invoice already, so I don't know. They may be paying it or they're going to do it afterwards, but we're going to get started. Ready? All right. Halfway through, but James is trying to trying to say we're about halfway through. We got this little bit here and that pile over there. Sometimes you have to worry about. I think that's a dead rat right there too. Where? Yep, that's a dead rat. Okay, well, we're not taking I thought I saw smell something stinking. We're not taking the dead rat, and... Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Let's get some of this weight off here. And just the one? Oh, look! That's pretty my blue. man Phil. Phil's kind of crabby today. It's Good. pretty blue too. He's like a cobalt blue on this crown. His friend Rob is dead. That's why. No. He's not feeling it. It's very territorial. Look at him. He's so proud. Look at him. Don't worry, little guy. We won't eat you. Okay. Got a funny story. My father had one of those things stuck in his boot. Kept getting his, trying to get his foot in his boot, it wouldn't work. And then this little crab, not this one, but the species, came crawling out of his uh, shoe. <laughs> okay, we got self. We gotta be careful. There's uh, self-tapping screws. Yeah. Uh, and this is, yeah, go ahead. Let him pinch you. Now what are you going to do? No, I, Don't I, you dare fling him on me, I I'm swear to God. To do that. I took my finger out of there to let him do that. Come on, let go. He won't let go. Let go. He won't let go. He'll let go. He won't. He already let go of one. Yeah, and he's switching claws. Trust me. And look at him, grabbing on to everything to dear life. See? Just let go and you can drop to the floor, see? Aha! Told you to let go. Aw, his arm's tired. He's having a hard time holding it up. <laughs> no, he's still fighting. <gasps> Would you, did you call the rat Ralph? I don't know, you have to rewind it. I don't have that good of a memory. No, I was thinking, I was thinking, oh, what is that game that we used to play as kids? Oh, with the rage. No, I think it was called Rage, with the rhino and the lizard and the... Rampage. Rampage. They made a movie. That's right, Rampage. Ralph was the wolf. Was he the wolf? Yeah. I don't know who the rat was. Does anybody remember the name of the rat? I remember the lizard. That was easy, Lizzie. All right. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put these things on here real quick, and then I'm gonna back over there. It's easier to back on that side. Okay. James is going to pull out over a mat over there. I'm gonna cut it now so we can. I gotta help him. Oh. Surprise. Nice piece of the metal. Yeah, check it out. Okay. Gotta be thick. 
So, my thumb, I don't know. Three and a half, three inch L iron, two and a half inch, something like that, L iron. This PVC tubes, what are these? 16 to 18 feet long PVC tubes. Yeah, they go all the way. That's because this place, you know, everything inside is. Well, yeah, look at the, look at the building. The building is like a quarter I'm, mile long. Yeah, I was saying before when I showed that it's Urban Air Park in PFL that it'd be nice one day we got to shoot some footage inside. We'd go there just on a day off. Seriously, we got to go on a day off. That'd be nice. Well, we should ask them, be like, now that we're like on the uh, steadily in everyone's roller decks. Bro, roller decks? Oh, that thingy that you. Oh, yeah, 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 because they've called multiple t that times before and after. I mean, before this place even started opening up. Watch yourself. I'm moving back for weight. Oops. Do you need help? No. I'm flipping it over. James got a little stuckies. Yeah, it felt stuck. That's like three dimensional. <laughs> Hopefully, Mr. Gracie Lou Freebush didn't crack those orange pieces. James and I like to upcycle. What happened? We like to upcycle. If we can. I wanted to have all the L's painted the same way because I was going to put these up on top of them. But there's more yellows, so when we're done, we got to put these on top. See, when we saw this part, we're like, oh, that doesn't look too bad. Yeah, we would have been. And we got like inches from it, but oh no, these See these are had to thick. Wait out, the, wait out the rain. Yeah. Raining sheets, as they say. Woo. So, this is the pile that's left. So we got one, two, three, four, five black L irons. One, two, three yellow ones left, and a couple small pieces. These will come in handy when we do some custom work on the trailer or something, you know. Oh, absolutely. Might as well upcycle and save them. Oh, I don't want to drag it. Normally I would be helping him with this, but he wants me to record, so... Fine by me. <laughs> Those smaller square pieces I'll get. They don't look so heavy. Excuse me. Sure, I'll take one of the Balance of a hand truck. Yeah. No sense carrying. Pay attention because there's screws all over the place. Yeah. Like right watching. there. Attention! <laughs> See, that's what I get for playing Assassin's Creed. <laughs> Heard Italian <laughs> in the game. When I played Assassin's Creed, I heard a tie-in in the game. <laughs> Rosetta Stone, please. <laughs> those, can you grab? Yeah, can you grab those? The two square tubes. Yeah, the two squares, and that sheet metal. Okay, All right. I got to help the man. Okie dokie. James is finally done. No, I'm just teasing. He worked really hard. All this stuff in here is super heavy. I wouldn't even try it myself. Okay. I 
And let me just turn around so you see the back side. And do you see what's in the trailer? We see we are nice and clean. Just some. These are the lighter pieces. Teeny tiny pieces. Okay. Let's get out of here before it rains again. Now we're going to send the, attach the after photos to the invoice and send it out? Yep, attach the after photos to the invoice and send it out, regardless if they paid, he says. The client that called us said that there was nothing outside longer than seven feet. Um, so this is less than seven feet long. And there's the top. <laughs> and come down. Even with a 14 foot long trailer. Yeah, that's not seven feet. 